and show you guys how I'm going into the new year looking like a bad bitch, period. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to another weekly vlog. If you are new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications, and follow me on Instagram at Birkin Coco. You know how to spell Birkin, and you know how to spell Coco. Um, be sure to subscribe to my Patreon. The link is down in the description. Remember, once I get to 50K, I'm giving away some money and free access onto my Patreon if you would like. So make sure that you're subscribed, following me on Instagram and commenting down below with your cash app and all of that great stuff. It is Tuesday, December 28th. It is a few days after Christmas. Um, if you haven't watched my Christmas vlog, go ahead and watch that vlog. But we are basically going into the New Year's in a few days. So I wanted to start this vlog off um, and, you know, basically get shit popping before we go into the New Year's. <laughs> um, so as you can see, I'm already dressed. I'm in the house. Um, I have on... <laughs> I have on this cardigan that I believe I got from Aritzia or um, Zara, but I'm pretty sure it's Aritzia. And then I have these jeans that I definitely got from Zara. And yeah, I don't have my shoes on yet, but most likely I'm just gonna wear some boots and throw a jacket on. As you guys know, I live in Massachusetts, so it's pretty cold. Um, I'm going to be taking my new Lady Dior that I got for my Christmas present and my, you know, 20K subscriber present to myself. <laughs> um, so today we have a few errands to run. I need to go to Cartier because one of my presents from a Tattoo Daddy was from Cartier. Um, if you guys don't remember, he had gotten me a ring a while ago. Um, but I lost it while I was on a boat this summer. So basically he replaced it. Um, and then I also have to go to Saks because it's basically, I think they're having like an after Christmas sale, um, thing. So I want to go in there and try to see if I can find a few things. The cardigan from my last vlog, my Christmas vlog or whatever, um, I want to go get the black version of that because they have the black version and I never got it. I got that nude, it's like white but nude version. And when I threw that shit on, I was like, oh my God, this is really cute. So I have to go and get the black one because the black one is more practical, um, especially for my dark skin. I know I wear a lot of makeup um, and my makeup is dark. You know, I'm a dark skinned woman, so I wear dark skin makeup and um, I just feel like getting the black version will work more with a lot of my outfits and it'll get less damaged. So I wanna go get that. And I also need to return this dress. Um, I had also gotten this dress from um, Saks, which was basically supposed to be the dress that I was gonna wear to um, the ballet. But, of course, it didn't come on time, even though I paid for, um, basically, I think it was like a two-day delivery or next-day delivery, but they never sent my shirt. So, I had to basically cancel the order for the shoes that I wanted, but they couldn't cancel the order for the dress. So, they ended up shipping the dress either way, so I have to go return it and get my money back. Um... Here's the receipt. The dress was 302 bucks. Uh, yeah, and I think they put it on the card. I don't know, but either way, I have to go return the dress. It was a really cute dress. Very long and extravagant, like, I don't know. I didn't try it on, but I don't see myself going anywhere else um, where I'll need something this extravagant. And it's a white dress, so. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go ahead and return the dress. But it was super cute. I mean, the black dress that I got in war, you guys saw in that vlog, was super cute. Um, I loved it. So I ended up keeping that dress, and obviously I wore it. But this one I definitely have to return. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take this back to uh, Saks and return it. 
Um, also, like I said, I need to stop. Um, also, like I said, I need to stop at Cartier um, because my ring that he got me, um, he got me the wrong size. So I have to go see if I can get, this is the certificate of authenticity. Um, I need to go ahead and return so that, um, you know, they can give me the right size. But this is the ring. It's just a tiny little um, love ring um, to match my love bracelet. Oh, let's see. To match my love, okay. Yeah, to match my love bracelet. Um, yeah, but it didn't fit, so I have to go get a different size. Um, yeah, so that's what we're going to do today. We're going to try and return this stuff. Do a little bit of shopping. And then also, also I'm thinking of stopping by um, a coffee shop or maybe a restaurant and I'll sit and do some work on my computer. I need to edit this vlog. I'm talking about some of you guys go watch my Christmas vlog. That's because I, I, I haven't edited the vlog yet. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna try to do that today and get that up for you guys. Um, so I'm pro probably, ugh, I can't talk, I can never talk. So I'm probably going to stop at a coffee shop or a restaurant and do that. So that is basically the plan for today. Oh, I need to stop at Western Union, which is right down the street, to send this girl's money. One of the girls that won my last giveaway, I never ended up sending her her money because she lives in Jamaica and she needed her money Western Union to her. The other two girls were PayPal, that was easy. I did it practically the same day. I've just been really busy and then I was sick for the last two days, so didn't get the chance to do it. So I'm gonna do that today so she doesn't think I was bullshitting with her. Um, but yeah, so that is pretty much the plan for today. And yeah, let's go ahead. Guys, right, so I just got out of Saks. I'm in the parking garage right now. Um, I am feeling exhausted. So I had stopped by Cartier first and um, packed, okay? Like, packed. <laughs> um, like, the line was at the door. I mean, obviously, you guys know that they only allow, like, a certain capacity these days in most retail stores. Um, so it was really packed and there were a bunch of people standing outside and you know it's cold outside so I just wasn't gonna stand outside so I might postpone it but I'm gonna drive by again and see if it's still as busy as it was when I first stopped there because I stopped there first um, but then I went to Saks and returned the dress that I was telling you guys about and then I got the black version of that um, cardigan that I had won in my last vlog <laughs> And I was saying I might stop by a coffee shop and get myself like some coffee and do some work You know try to edit this vlog, but to be honest with you. I feel exhausted like I told you guys that I was sick and I Had a fever for like the last two days. So Today was been today was like the first day I was feeling a little better and I was like let me go run some errands but I'm exhausted from being outside for like an hour and a half so I'm gonna go back in the house and get back in my bed and edit from my bed because I just don't want to get sick again and I don't want to um, you know push my limit like I feel like my fever is coming back my body is starting to get hot again so I think I should just go get back in my bed and um, edit from there uh, take some Tylenol and just relax but um, I don't want to push it and then you know get really sick again because I was like I was such a baby <laughs> the last two days I was such a baby um, but yeah so that's what we're doing but like I said I'm gonna drive by Cartier again and see if uh, if they're as busy because I really want to return that ring and get my size um, for my you know fingers 
so the whole shebang can be there but <laughs> at the same time I'm not standing in the cold because I'm already not feeling too good so yeah but anyways let me get out of here um, and I will see you guys once I get out of this parking garage all right back in the house like I said didn't uh, switch out the ring like I intended to so we're gonna try again tomorrow but I did go to Saks and I did switch out the um, dress well I returned the dress and I ended up getting the black version of that cardigan I was talking about um, so I'm gonna try that on for you guys quickly the white one was just so luxurious like I just could not see myself wearing that every day and it would last so I ended up getting the black one now I did get a medium in the white version because that's all they had available but this is an extra small in black so it's a little bit more fitted um, but I don't really think you could tell the difference much with how it fits but this one is definitely more fitted definitely more my size you guys know I am a small in everything well I'm, I, I'm an extra small in everything I'm a zero in pant sometimes a zero zero it's sad <laughs> um, but yeah so this is the black version of the coat well it's not a coat it's a cardigan I said that already um, yeah super cute this cardigan was originally about $300 and uh, on sale it was $165 so yeah cute um, anyways so I'm gonna sit down and edit um, I ended up getting some wine Ooh, what is this oh it's lint I was like I hope they didn't give me a stained um, item but no it was just some lint uh, yeah so I'm gonna sit down Pour myself a glass of wine and edit this vlog and hopefully try to get it up today it's already 3:55, so if i can get it up by seven o'clock that would be great so that's like four hours from now maybe eight o'clock but um yeah so that is pretty much going to be what today is like i said i ended up feeling a little uh weak as i was out so I just wanted to come home and just get in my bed or sit on my couch and not do too much because I don't want to like relapse and go back to being sick again so well I'm still technically sick but I'm a lot better than I was you know yesterday so I'm gonna try not to get back to the point I was yesterday and just relax and not push myself to do too much stuff so yeah I just wanted to show you guys this cardigan very cute <laughs> all right hi guys okay it's been a few days <laughs> actually no i'm lying it's been a day um since i spoke to you guys i posted my last vlog this morning go check it out if you haven't checked it out but i have a new package and i'm so excited okay i peeked I peaked. I'm not even gonna lie. I peaked. But ah! I'm so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh my god. If you guys remember a couple vlogs ago, I was like, I wanted some Tiffany glasses. And oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guess what I got? Guess what I got? Make sure my um, thing isn't showing. I get some Tiffany wine glasses. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, I have to take a picture. Hold on. I have to take a picture. Real quick. We're gonna open it. Ah! <laughs> I'm too excited. Ah! Oh, here we 
period. Period. Yep. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Give it to me. Give it to me. Oh. Oh yeah. My bougie level is beyond me at this point. Bitch. Tiffany wine glasses. I'll wait. <laughs> oh my god, like I literally was not expecting this. I was not expecting this. He told me I had a surprise and I was like, oh, what is it? I kept insisting, like, tell me what it is, tell me what it is. And he was like, no, it's something you wished for. And I was just like, I don't remember. <laughs> Like asking for anything, you know, like I told you guys he's sending me stuff on my Amazon wish list because I move in But like when I had did my Vlog so the vlog prior to the last vlog that I posted and I said, oh, you know, I'm gonna ask him for um, Tiffany wine glasses They were sold out practically everywhere So I did not expect that like he was going to keep like, you know, looking so today is thursday december 30th it is literally oh damn what's today yeah thursday we literally have one more day in 2021 it is what time is it <clears throat> i have a clock right behind me i never look at it it is 9 i need glasses <laughs> You guys saw my excitement yesterday for my Tiffany glasses, right? <laughs> I used one already, so here we go. I gotta wash all these wine glasses, wash my dishes, because um, I have a maid coming to clean my house. We are starting the new year with a clean, beautiful house. So, I have to wash these dishes. I have to prep before the maid comes. Like, what is your job, sis? Isn't your job to wash my dishes, do my laundry? <laughs> so I guess she's not a maid, she's a cleaner. Um, I have a cleaner coming at 10 o'clock, so I have about an hour to get all of this stuff clean. I also have to go to my laser appointment, and I also have a consultation for something. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog it. I don't know, I don't know, I'm scared. Um, we'll see. But I have to wash these dishes um, I'm gonna probably come back and do laundry so we can start off the new year with clean house no dirty laundry you know like clean everything so 2022 can be a fantastic year so that's what we're gonna do right now um, as you can see I just got up so don't mind my face if I look dry any of that stuff because yes I've become that bougie in my life that I need a cleaner to clean my house okay period mainly my floors because my floors are a mess and it's a lot of work and I don't like to with them so yeah and the bathroom I mean I clean my bathroom so that's not really a big deal but These are all the ones, like, listen. 
It's gonna make me look like I'm a straight alcoholic, the amount of wine glasses that I have in my sink right now, but that's only because I have so many wine glasses <coughs> that I just use them and use them and use them and don't wash them. my laser appointment so that was my last laser session um so what i was saying or hinting that i was gonna do <laughs> so i was going to have a consultation to get lip injections um obviously a consultation and then decide if i wanted to do it um i don't know but i like my lips but like I feel like my bottom lip is longer than my top lip so I wanted to even them out <laughs> um, so I was you know something I've been thinking about and I had basically scheduled my last laser appointment this laser appointment um, with you know well the same day I was going to do the um, lip injections consultation but when I was sick, because my appointment was actually on Monday. Um, today is Thursday, by the way. So my original appointment was on Monday, and I scheduled it for the same day. So um, I was supposed to do it right after I had my laser appointment. But because I was sick and I wasn't feeling well on Monday, I was feeling really bad. So I canceled um, the appointment, and I rescheduled it to today. But the lady didn't schedule a consultation. So unfortunately... We didn't do that today. Um, well, not unfortunately, because I don't know if I'm really like certain that I'm gonna do it. I know it's something that I want to try. And it's something that if you don't like, you can dissolve them, you can take them off. Um, so, anyways, long story short, my appointment for my lip consultation is actually now on uh, January 4th. So I think next week yeah tuesday of next week so we'll see i don't know if it's something that i want to do yet but i know it's something that i've been thinking about doing i don't want to look like a weirdo you know what i'm saying <laughs> like i'm not on i'm not big on like major surgeries if that's is that is that even considered surgery I don't think so. I just think that's just an enhancement. Um, you know, it's not like I'm getting like my boobs done or like getting a BBL. Like, no, it's just like I'm gonna get some like lip injections or something and see what it, it we'll see what it does. You know, like I'm already cute. You know, like I don't need like you know what do you call it Botox and all of that stuff. Like I don't need all that. Mm -hmm, okay, just my lips. And then we'll see what it's given because I want my lips to be plump and luscious at all times. <laughs> anyway, so me and Chanel are just sitting in the car because um, the cleaner is at my house right now. I'm cleaning. And like, not to be weird, I just feel awkward being there while she's cleaning. <laughs> is that weird? I feel like that's weird, but it's not. I just feel weird. Like, why will I just be sitting there looking at her while she's cleaning? Um... But yeah, so 
Oh well. <laughs> oh well. But so me and Chanel are just in the car now, trying to pass some time. Probably gonna go to Starbucks, get myself a smoothie or something because I'm feeling really weak. I need something like a green juice or something. And then I'll probably take Chanel and walk her around Newberry Street. But I didn't pay for parking because usually my laser appointments are literally five minutes so I was in there for five minutes um, and so I didn't pay for parking so I don't want to walk her and then I get a ticket because I definitely just saw the lady walking around handing out tickets <laughs> handing out big fat tickets Chanel so um, I don't want one I already have enough tickets that I haven't paid for that I got a dispute okay um yeah Chanel you're so cute you're so cute Chanel <laughs> she's just looking at me like what are you talking about but anyway so yeah I think I'm just gonna rent a Starbucks or something try to pass some time um while this lady is cleaning my house yeah, so it's a rainy day in Boston, so I'm probably not going to be doing much today aside from what you just saw, which was, you know, get my laser hair, the cleaners at my house. Um, yeah, run to Starbucks. And I'm going to go back home and get in my bed because uh, there's nothing to do and I feel a little weak. Oh, I did return that ring. I so forgot to mention. I did return, not return, but I did... Um, I did get my um, love ring sized and I got a better size to fit. Move it to my right hand because I just realized I'm blocking my own blessings walking around like I'm a married woman. And I'm single. Say hi Chanel. I cut her hair and washed her so she looks so much cleaner. I'm back in the house. Um, the cleaner just left. Uh, she did okay. I mean, I could have did it myself. <laughs> yeah, feel me, but I've just been sick. I told you guys I've been sick, not feeling well. Um, but my floors are clean or she cleaned my floors so that's a good thing but aside from that she really didn't do nothing um yeah she didn't do anything special i could have did it myself to be quite honest with you um i ended up getting myself a smoothie from this place called um do they have it on there okay <laughs> does not say um, I think it was like Mugly or something like that. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so we're back home. Me and Chanel, the floors are clean. My bathroom is cleaned. Um, yeah. So that's about it. <laughs> um, I don't know what else I'm going to do today, but to be honest with you, I'm going to get back in my bed. Her bed making skills are not it. <laughs> um, not great, but she made up my bed. She like switched my sheets, so that's fine. I'm gonna get in my nice clean sheets and go to sleep. <laughs> um, well, not go to sleep, but probably watch some movies, watch some, uh, I've been watching Girlfriends. I mean, I've watched it before and I finished it, but I just started watching it again because I saw it on Netflix. Um, they took it off Netflix and then they put it back. But yeah, so that's about it. My house smells nice though, so that's good. I like a nice smelling house, so that's good. Um, yeah, that's about it for today, guys. I don't know what else I'm gonna do. Like I said, pretty much I'm just gonna chill, relax, um, and uh, what is tomorrow? Tomorrow is New Year's Eve. So me and Tattoo Daddy are going to um, go somewhere and, uh, you know, bring in the New Year together. I was supposed to go to, or I was invited to go to uh, Vegas. You guys remember, um, oh, you guys probably don't know. 
don't know him because you're not on my Patreon. If you're on my Patreon, you will know. But Doctor, <laughs> I call him Doctor Daddy. Um, he invited me to go to Vegas with him um, and some of his friends for New Year's. But that plan ended up um, not working out. So we're just gonna be here in Boston for New Year's um, with TD. But yeah. So that is it, guys. I don't know what else I'm gonna do. If I do do something else today, I will come on here and let you guys know what I am doing. But as of now, we're gonna go watch Girlfriends or find a movie or something. Most likely probably take a nap too. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, it's raining outside. It's not great, so. Hi guys. Okay, so it is a New Year's Eve. It is a January, nope. It is Friday, December 31. It is 10.42 p.m. And as you can see, I'm in my New Year's fit. Okay, period. <laughs> um, yeah, so we are going out. And by we, I mean me and TD, me and Tattoo Daddy. We are going out to celebrate the New Year's. Um, and I wanted to show you guys my fit. You guys saw my... Um, from my previous vlog, <laughs> um, you guys saw when I went shopping and I got this dress and I got the dress for the ballet. And when I got this, I was like, oh, you know what? This would be a perfect New Year's. Um, this would be a perfect New Year's Eve dress. And you know, let me show you guys, okay? It's a given. This is my fit. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom. I have my Jimmy Choo's. But yeah. <laughs> if you were wondering where I got this dress from, I got it from Saks. I don't know the actual designer. But I got it from Saks. And I have Jimmy Choo's, Cartier. Cartier. No earrings. I don't think I'm going to wear any earrings, but. Mm -hmm. Okay. Period. <laughs> Bringing in the new year in a style, baby. Okay. Period. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so I did a little bit more makeup today. Um, some of the products from my last vlog when I went to Sephora and I showed you guys pretty much all of that. The um, Giorgio Armani foundation. I used the Fenty Beauty blush and then I did um, a highlight today. And yeah, pretty much that's it. I used the two lip liners that I bought um, when I went to Sephora and yeah. That is pretty much my a New Year's outfit. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's giving very much a sexy. <laughs> anyway, so my New Year resolution is to just keep growing on YouTube. Um, you know, making new friends and all of that great stuff. Because, you know, some of you guys become my friends. Especially if you're following me on Instagram. So make sure you're doing that. Okay. Your New Year resolution should be following me on every single platform um, but anyways um, what else you know I want to keep being a happy positive person um, I want to keep giving back as much as I can um, to the ones that I love to you guys you know on my patreon like I want to keep helping more girls be successful um, hmm, I want my bank account to grow period <laughs> And, um, yeah, and I just, you know, I want to keep me in the daddies, okay? We're, we're manifesting private jet daddy. <laughs> Hedge fund daddies. <laughs> okay, um, but yeah, that's my New Year resolution. I don't know about you guys. Let me know some of your New Year resolutions down in the comments below. Like, you know, what would you like to accomplish this year? Oh, 
that's something that I was just telling TD. I want to get my real, <laughs> I want to get my real estate license, and I'm not playing about it in 2022. Okay, in 2022, I'm getting my real estate license, and like I said, not because I need it, but because I just I know a backup plan, a backup plan. We always need a backup plan, and besides, I could be selling properties, you know, with my YouTube and the fact that I already have followers and stuff. So. Um, I could use that to, you know, be a successful real estate agent, period. But anyways, that's my new year resolutions. You guys let me know what your new year resolutions are down in the comments. But right now me and TD are waiting for the Uber. I don't know where he is. I think he's in the bathroom. We're waiting for the Uber. Um, I don't think I'm bringing you guys with me. So I just wanted to come on here and show you guys my fit and show you guys how I'm going into the new year looking like a bad bitch, period. <laughs> okay, period. <laughs> um, but yeah, so focus. Mm-hmm, yes. <laughs> Final fit through my cardigan over. So since I'm wearing my Jimmy Choo's, I decided to pair it with my gold Chanel. Uh, also, I'm wearing gold jewelry and on my Cartier. Yeah, so this is my New Year's outfit. So we're gonna go celebrate New Year's. Happy New Year's. I will see you guys tomorrow, which is gonna be the first day of 2022, 2022. <laughs> Anyways, I right, see you guys. We are going to go have some fun. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna record anything, but if I do, you will see it um, after this. So Happy New Year's, guys. Mwah. <laughs> I am actually on my way out. I'm rushing out. That's why, as you can see, I have no lip gloss on my lips. I'm about to take Chanel out to use the bathroom real quick. But I wanted to quickly show you guys my outfit. Um, so I'm wearing this Skims bodysuit. This Skims bodysuit. I believe I got this skirt from Aritzia like a while back. Um, but it's just this silk um, skirt. Very cute. Um, I'm going to be wearing my Jimmy Choo's. These gold babies that I wear practically all the time. I'm going to throw over my new favorite piece of clothing. And I'm going to take my classic Chanel. But since I'm taking Chanel downstairs um, to use the bathroom, I'm not putting on my shoes. I'm going to wear Uggs. Um, and then I'm going to come back, grab my bags, and then we're going to head out. But we are going to my lip consultation, by the way, if anyone cares. Um, that's where we're going. And I also have kind of a day tonight. So um, I'm going to my lip consultation. If I want it, I'll get it done. If not, go into my date and just move in from there. But come on, Chanel, let's go. We're taking you outside. Uh, not gum stuck under my shoe. That is disgusting. Uh, come on, Chanel. Hi guys, so <laughs> uh, I made it to my um, dinner spot where I'm going to be having dinner. This ballet guy is trying to get me out of the car so fast, but I'm over here wasting his time. Um, but anyway, so yeah, I ended up not getting my lips done because um, we'll talk about it later. Um, he's really at my door. I know I'm balling. Okay. Give it a second. Anyway, so I'm gonna go in here and uh, eat some dinner. It's right next to where I had my consultation, so I'm about to get out of this car before I get cursed out by the valet. I'm assuming he wants to make his money, so let me do that. Anyway, so yeah, 
As you can see, no lip fillers, unfortunately. But I will talk about that later when I get back in the house. Um, but yeah, so 